Hello guys! Welcome back for another sneaker review on my channel. Okay, so today guys, we are going to check on another sneaker. Actually, I'm happy and thankful that I got this pair. It is a good start for me this year because I won the raffle on this sneaker. I hope the whole year it's gonna be like this. So okay, for today's episode, we are going to check on my first sneaker that I got this year. This Air Jordan 1 is one of the popular, iconic, and my favorite colorway of the Air Jordan 1. This is the Air Jordan 1 bread in patent leather. So, before we check on the details of this, let me give you a little info about the Air Jordan 1 bread. Let's start with the Wings logo. So, the Wings logo, the inspiration of this was from the flight badges that were worn by commercial and military pilots. And also sometimes given as souvenirs for kids on flight. So, it all started when Peter Moore the designer of Air Jordan 1 saw a kid on the plane wearing a pilot pin on his shirt given by a stewardess. So he got this idea of merging wings and basketball. And he did the drawing while flying back home using a cocktail napkin. The Air Jordan 1 debuted in 1985. So this Air Jordan 1 bread colorway was made to match Michael Jordan's Chicago Bulls jersey. Before the Air Jordan 1, majority of the basketball shoes was colored white with minimal color. Then when the Air Jordan 1 came out, it was in black and red. So the NBA sent a letter to Nike stating that the shoes colorway did not comply the NBA's uniform rules and procedures. That is why this Air Jordan 1 black and red colorway is also known as band. Okay, so now let's check on the details of this Air Jordan 1 red patent leather. with the box so the box of our Air Jordan 1 bread is just the same with the other box of your Air Jordan 1 high the difference is that this one is shiny because they match it with the sneaker itself okay so the official colorway of this is black varsity red white Okay, so let's go to the shoe itself. So the upper of our Air Jordan 1 bread is made up of patent leather. So expect that this one is a little bit stiff. And then if you're going to check the, the red on our 2016 release and on our new release bread, you'll see that the red on our new release is more vibrant than our 2016 release i think because this one is uh, patent leather so it is shiny okay so let's go to the front side of this shoe 
So on the front side, you'll see the, the red toe box and black uh, toe guard wrapping up to our eyelids. And then uh, we have two laces on this. The default one is the black one. And then if you want your sneaker to pop even more, you can use the red one. And then uh, we, we have the standard nylon tongue with the black tag and red Nike Air logo on top. And then on our sock liner, we have a black sock liner. And then on the side of it, there's a family embroidered on it in red. And then going to our uh, lateral side, on our lateral side, you'll see the black patent leather on the mid panel and then red on the swoosh and then also red here on the logo uh, Air Jordan Wings logo location. And then on the right pair, what you can see on the lateral side is this uh, uh, Jumpman logo hang tag. So this one is, is really good. And then what you can see on the lateral side is just the same with the medial side. And then going to the, the back side, uh, on our back side, we have this uh, red. And then on the ankle collar, we have, we have a black uh, patent leather. And then on the midsole, we have a white midsole. And then on the outsole, we have a red outsole with the Nike logo at the middle. And then also on our insole, we have a black insole with the red Nike Air logo inside. Okay, so that's the construction of our Air Jordan 1 bread patent leather. Okay, so my thoughts on this uh, Air Jordan 1 bread patent leather. I think this is a dope sneaker. Uh, actually, I'm not a fan of uh, patent leather on Jordan 1. But on this one, it's different. I really like it. I like it a lot. So I also bought one for my daughter. And it looks cute on her. And she likes it too. Okay, so and then uh, the vibrant red on this sneaker makes it more gorgeous. And one thing I also like about this is the Jamal logo hang tag that they put on it. This detail makes this sneaker more premium and special. Okay, so let me know your thoughts about this Air Jordan 1 bread patent leather. You can just comment it down below. Okay, so that's my review on this uh, Air Jordan 1 bread patent leather. Uh, shout out to Pinoy Sneakerheads in Taiwan, to all the members and specialist admins, and to uh, Aris Romano. Thank you so much for your continued support. And also to Sir Ruel Lobao. He is one of our idol here in Taiwan when it comes to sneaker collection. Okay, so that's it for my video. Thank you all for watching. See you next time. Bye!